okay so good morning students now we will discuss about pressure line problem problem of pressure line or thrust line so already we have discussed the concept of pressure line now we will discuss the problem so here a pre stressed concrete beam with rectangular section of 120 mm so 120 mm wide and 300 mm depth with 6 meters and udl 4 kg per meter which included sulfate and the effective span is 6 meters the beam is concentrically pre stressed with force 118 kN locate the position of pressure line so you should locate the position of pressure line that is the pressure line position with some eccentrical distance so what is the eccentrical distance okay so first we will take the given pre stressed force P180 eccentricity E0 so you should find out Okay, so already told what is meant by pre stressed concrete. It is a combination of both direct stress and bending stress. So the concept is combination of both direct stress and bending stress, which gives the resultant stress. So we discussed in the previous problem also. Okay, so here area I and Z. So area P hundred into L into V into D I V D cube by twelve Z section modulus I by Y. So we will get the values of by substituting the values. Here first maximum bending moment. What is it? Maximum bending moment. W L square by 8. W means 6. L W means 4. L 6 meters and 8. We will get 18 kilonewtons meter. And direct stress P by 8. Direct stress P by 8. 180 into 10 cube by 270 into 10 power 6. So, so direct stress P by A and bending stress M by Z we are, have already known by solving previous problem. So here direct stress and P by A we will get 5 and bending stress we will get 10. So here direct stress P by A and bending stress only M by Z not this one only this one okay. So P by A M by Z. So here the resultant stress means combination of both. So here we have plus and plus 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 minus minus. Okay now we have discussed the resultant stress but in the given problem we should discuss we should find the pressure line the pressure line okay so the pressure line formula for the shift of pressure line is ft is equal to e by a plus p into e by z so here main concept lies in resultant line resultant stress at top and bottom so we will take top okay so p by a plus p into e by z so p load by area plus load by area into the value of eccentricity. So by solving the equation, we will get the value of eccentricity value 100 mm. So we will represent in figure. So this is the rectangular beam and the rectangular beam cross section. So the pressure line, the precessing force 180 kN, the line, the precessing will be the form of UDL in shape. Why UDL means, sorry, why parabolic means the given load is UDL. The given load is UDL. So the precessing force term will be in parabolic shape and the eccentrical distance <coughs> will be 100 mm which we will get the answer so this is the line where the resultant stress shifts the shifts the results shifts the pressure shifts the pressure so for this we will have span one <coughs> for this 3 by 4 we will have one pressure value for the length L by 2 we will have one pressure value for a quarter span, we will have one pressure value. So, in the question, they can they may ask, look at the pressure line, or look at the pressure line, quarter span, or look at the pressure line at center, or look at the pressure line in three by fourth span. So, we will calculate the values. Okay. So, the main concept of calculating the pressure line is the load will be shifted. The load will be shifted on the beam where the pressure line also tends to increase into decreasing position and the location of pressure line will be asked L by 2 or quarter span or mid span or 3 by 4th of span. So this all overall this concept comes under pressure line and thrust line. These are the types of problems which were asked in previous papers. So they will ask look at the pressure line or even the section calculate bending stress, direct stress, dead load, live load and plot the 
resultant stress plot the resultant stress at top and bottom these are the two problems which were asked so much previously okay or theoretically they will ask types of precious methods okay poor long run method and the respected problems so two marks means what is pressure line or thrust line okay what is pressure line or thrust line analysis of stresses load balancing concept etc these are the very very important question